What if you don't like your child's friends? What if they're not a good influence? What do you do? This is a good question and parents ask me this all the time. And I kind of want to throw that question back in your face only because I really want parents to begin to stop looking outside of themselves for every answer when it comes to parenting. I could talk myself out of a job that way and I, I don't want to because I love helping parents, but what I love helping parents do is figure out how to reconnect with themselves and their own intuition so they have the answer. Because let's face it, nobody knows your child like you. If I am answering this question, what would I do if I didn't like one of my kids' friends or thought they were a bad influence on them or a group of friends? My answer as a mom would be, first of all, I know the more negative I say, the more drawn they're going to be, whether it's to a friend or a boyfriend or a girlfriend. The point is, generally when we try and tamper things out, we most definitely can drive our kids to it. So what I would do as a mom is put some things together that I know about this kid and have a sit down conversation with my teenager and say, listen, I just have to let you know that I've seen this and this and this, and I'm concerned about how so-and-so is affecting you. I love and care about you. Our family values are honesty, um, no drinking, no drug use. And my concern is that your friendship or your relationship with so-and-so is affecting how you're going to make choices about your life. I have zero desire or need to control you, but I do love and care about you and wanna tell you how I feel. I know you think you don't have any influence over your teenager, but the reality is you do. And sometimes it's about being honest and vulnerable and sharing with your kid exactly how you feel, connecting with them from the heart. That doesn't mean their behavior is gonna change overnight or they're gonna all of a sudden dislike this friend, but it's gonna get them thinking. And that's the first step. I'm curious if you've been in this situation and what you've done in the past when you didn't agree with a friend or a romantic interest that your child had, how you handled it.